Really, really reckless driver speeding and cutting in and out of traffic. So this is a unit um, that was watching this guy driving crazy on I-10. He stopped him, got his driver license, and he's going to escort him off here. On his way home from work. Right. All right. Uh, from Chandler, said he had one beer. Blew by me on the shoulder, probably Charles, about 16, 55 mile an hour. Walked up there, eyes bloodshot, water, a hand of alcohol. Mm -hmm. I got his license, he had a firearm. That's in my car, I'll place it in yours. Okay. How are you, sir? I'm Trooper Jacobs. I'm gonna be doing just a couple tests. You just make sure you're all right to drive, okay? okay. What I'm gonna do is, is I'm gonna have you follow the tip of my pen with your eyes, but keep your head absolutely still, okay? No worries, this is getting a little warm out here. I understand. I I'm wearing a wool and a bulletproof vest. I just don't understand all this. Well, you're driving on the shoulder at 55 plus? Uh, I was doing more like 25, but yeah, I get it. I get on the it. shoulder? Don't worry. Uh, mm -hmm. OK. So do me a favor. Face me. Right on that line in the middle there. Yeah. So put your feet together, have your hands at your side. And what I want you to do right now is, is put your right foot in front of your left heel to toe. Do I need to do this, or do I need to call a lawyer? Because I didn't even see you be able to do it. I mean, I don't get the, like, what's the point of this? You don't have to do it, but this is how I'm going to determine whether I'm going to let you drive or not. All right, all right, fair enough. I was just saying, I, I, it's really tough to do that. Well, I'm doing it with a duty belt on. I'll do it. I'll do it. Okay, so keep your hands at your side for me. You want, you want me to demonstrate again here for you? No, no, I got it. You're absolutely certain that you're good to drive. So do me a favor. What I want you to do when I tell you to is take a really deep breath and blow out until I tell you to stop. Okay? Really deep breath and blow. Blow, 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 blow. Okay, good. So you know what the legal limit is in Arizona? 0.08. Yeah, here are 132. So you are DUI in Arizona, so I'm placing you under arrest, okay? That sounds pretty off. No, not, not, not based on what I saw. Based on what I just did on the test? Yeah. Well, my test is fine. That's uh, your opinion, not mine. Can you breath live without me responding yes to it? Yeah, I can. Okay. All right, all right. I'll talk to my lawyer about it, but I'm pretty sure you can. Okay. Then, then man, you've got this case beat. I'm really worried. Really? You're going to arrest me for this? 774. Yeah. Sir. You're DUI. That's dangerous. Man. What if I get a ride home from here? No way. Too late for that. You should have thought of that before you drunk and drive. There's nothing you can do. That's correct. So that would be called malfeasance. be a violation of my oath. Hey, that's a $200 pen. Okay. Hey, I broke his pen. 200 bucks. Okay. All right, All right now. Yeah. <clears throat> Never mind you taking a $20,000 truck and driving under the influence. $10, Worried $10, about this. Driving just fine. Okay. And a 132. You're just full of excuses. I really like it. I, I would just let you go because DUIs don't kill families and troopers and other people, right? You, you're just an innocent victim here. You can keep shaking your head at me, man. I don't know what you want me to do. Let me go home. No. No. No, you're not under an 08, and we're done. Okay. Sorry. Okay, well, this is the inconveniences of being arrested. All right, so there's a trooper who's going to finish processing our guy here. He's going to go down to the station. We'll do a duplicate breath test, maybe a blood test, and then uh, he's going to be booked into jail for DUI. Let's lose Mr. Victim's vodka here, since we're all in the state of Arizona just really abusing him and uh, making a victim out of him. He's just, uh, boy, how unfortunate. Police are here to protect the serve. Everyone should take accountability. We should all look to law and order. There should be justice. You should trust the police. There should be a lot more transparency. We should come together as a we nation. Fight. There should have been. We should.